So as we've mentioned, we're going to witness how God is changing lives. And uh, so we believe at Grace that the baptism is an outward confession. It's an act of obedience. And the, it's the outward confession uh, resulting from an inward change, a new heart. So uh, these ladies that will be going in the water and, and getting baptized, uh, they are a new creation in Christ. In a sense, this water is, is a symbol that they've been washed white as snow. And though they were dead, they are alive in Christ. And uh, they're going to have uh, their testimonies up on the screen, and then we'll get to witness and celebrate what God is doing in their lives. Please watch. Hi, my name is Natalie, and I've been at Grace to about about three years. Natalie, do you believe that you're a sinner? Yes. Do you believe that Jesus died on the cross for your sins? Yes. Do you love Jesus with all your heart? Yes. Is he your Savior? So, can you tell me a little bit about how you came to know about Jesus and what he's done for you? I was laying in bed reading a book that Mommy got me called Prayers for Jesus. I want to be baptized because I want to show the world that I'm a true Christian. Natalie Van Valkenburg, great to have you here with your dad, Ryan. Thank you for your testimony of faith in Jesus. And based on that testimony, Natalie, we baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Raise your hands. Congratulations. My name is Rachel Harris, and I began attending Grace this last summer, off and on, and have regularly been attending since September. I spent 17 years in a very horrible drug addiction. Um, I spent most of that time being an atheist. After many run-ins with law enforcement and being incarcerated, I finally checked into rehab and got clean. Shortly after that, I had a friend invite me to a women's encounter, and that is where I began my walk with Christ. And that is where I decided that I knew there was a power greater than myself since I've been able to overcome this addiction. And I want to be baptized because I want the world to know my love for Jesus and there is hope, healing, and forgiveness in him. And we're never too lost to be found. And there is always a way out of addiction. Amen. Amen. Rachel. Harris, thank you for your testimony of faith in Jesus. And based on your testimony, I baptize you in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Let's pray. Awesome, God. Thank you for being a God that changes lives, that uh, you pursue us. Your grace pursues us. Your love pursues us. Thank you that you're doing great things in our midst. Uh, we give you the glory. Would you continue to bring people to saving faith in Christ? Use us, your people. We thank you for these testimonies. For these ladies, I pray that they would follow you all the days of their life. I pray that they would grow in their love for you and their love for others and you would give them opportunities to share their faith and lead others to the saving faith that is in Jesus. God, I'm so thankful to be a part of this and what you're doing. I pray you would speak to our hearts this morning. I pray that you would encourage, equip, and strengthen your church this morning. These things we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. <laughs> 